And now to the next item, a monk's guide to a clean house and mind. That's what we need in these times. Conversationist Shuke Matsumoto shares traditional techniques on how to be calm in a turbulent global time in this Power Off segment. Hi, my name is Shoukei Matsumoto. I'm a Buddhist monk at Komyoji Temple in Tokyo, and I'm also the author of books A Monk's Guide to a Clean House Mind and Soji Within Yourself. Today, I'd like to speak about what we can learn from Buddhism about achieving inner peace through good habits. When talking about Zen, inner peace or mindfulness, people usually think of meditation. But I don't think that it is only about meditation. Every aspect of our daily life can become Zen, and among these, there is Soji. Soji means cleaning in Japanese. But as a Buddhist monk, Soji for me is not just about the physical act of cleaning, it's meditation in motion. Just like other uh, actions, such as cooking or driving, you might end up moving on autopilot and increase your concentration level. Soji can become a tool to cleanse your mind from anxieties and become an opportunity for reflection. It's easier to approach compared to traditional meditation on something you are already doing in your daily life. In Japanese schools, it is normal for the students to be in charge of cleaning their own classrooms. There are also many corporate leaders who incorporated cleaning in their company culture. This could be emblematic of Japanese people being well-mannered, but it is also linked to soji becoming a ritual. The same can be said about Buddhist monks. Monks actually spend more time cleaning than meditating, and not just newcomers, all the monks in the temple clean together because it's not a chore that we would rather avoid. In fact, the preparation and cleaning of the place for meditation is just as important as meditating itself. Buddhism means path to enlightenment, a path that is made of routines. The temple becomes the training space to practice those habits, and the life of monks revolves around practicing. This way, every part of life becomes Zen. At its base, Buddhism is about having good habits, and among those, there is Soji. It is not about the technique. It is practice for the mind to achieve their inner calm. And even if you are not a monk, cleaning can be more than a duty, a waste of time or energy. It can become your own ritual to practice cleaning your mind by cleaning your environment. I hope that Soji will help you find a new way to free yourself from obsessions and anxieties and get some inner peace every day. Thank you for watching.